Hey there everyone, thank you for joining me for this week's collector pack video. Uh, this week we have one of these mystery boxes. Could have one of many random collector packs in it. And normally I would do two set boosters of whatever collector booster I'm open, but since I don't know what I'm going to get, I decided maybe we'll do three of these. Plus, it gives me a chance to use a kind of silly box cutter, dagger looking thing like I see people get to use on box opening videos. So, here we go. Let's figure out what we got. Well, this is a little pointed. I need to make sure we're being careful. And that does not seem safe at all, huh? Phyrexia. Not terrible, but not great. Second box. Let's see what we got here. We got a Dominaria United. And for the third box. Alright, sorry about that. I'm not sure what happened with the video there, but this was the third pack. It's Brothers War. So, go ahead and open these up. And may as well do Frexia first. Open that first. See what we got here. Got that glue on there. They even can get these open. My goodness. Alright, well. So this whole video has just been no good from the start. Hopefully it turns around with these cards. Get those out of the way. Okay, for a token. The Phyrexian Goblin, the Phyrexian Might. Okay, we got a Mythic. So Pandrel Hunger Dominus. Archfiend of Dross. Oh wow. That foil. That's amazing. Missouri Stalker of Spheres. Necrogen Rat Priest. Sawblade Scamp. Irtet Remnant of Menarch. That's for the Commander. Monument of, or sorry, Monument to Perfection. And we got Monument to to perfection in the non-extended art. And I am not even really sure what that is. An island, I guess, obviously, but that's pretty cool. This is the first I've really seen of the set, so it's all kind of new to me. Rib skiff. Vehicle. Porcelain Zealot. Autonomous Furnace. So land. Right. Offer Immortality. Oh, Death Touch and Indestructible. That's cool. Vivisurgeon's uh, viv Insight? Vivisurgeon? Wow, that was bad. And Leonin Lightbringer. All right, that was it for the Phyrexian. Not for the Dominaria. I've seen a little bit of this set. I do like it. But 
land art of that Phryxian though. That was pretty sweet. All right, got a treasure card. That I do feel like is a good sign. And that bird looks nice. Geothermal Bog is my land. Impede Monument. Broken Wings. Oh, that's nice. Captain's Call. Czar. Ojin and Sion of Efrov? Efrova? <laughs> sure, that was right on point. Territorial Morrow. That's cool. There's a swap. That looks pretty nice as well. Aaron Benali's Ruin. Filer of Dreams, Archangel of Wrath. It's almost hard to read. Rolk Mons, Warren Chief. Jasmine Burial of the Seven. Okay, that's got some pretty nice abilities there, actually. Symmetry Dragon Master, and Commander. Cool. Aisha Tanaka Armor. Actually, it's actually pretty good too. And Chaotic Transformation. Okay, we actually got some pretty good cards as far as playability in that deck goes. That's always nice. Now for Brothers War, we have a Construct. And Power Stone token. All right, shoot down. Gixian Skull Flare. Sounds bad. Mishra's Onslaught. Emergency Weld. Defabricate. Heavyweight Demolisher, another island, that's got a giant golem looking creature, that's kind of cool. Death Bloom Ritualist, Queen Kayla Ben Krug, okay. Ashnav the Uncaring, Commander Series, ooh, Springleaf Drum. Cool. I like those retro borders, retro foils, whatever. Millstone, Goblin, Charbelcher. Alright, another retro. Ratchet, Field Medic. Not even fully sure what that's from. That looks pretty cool though. Rescue Racer vehicle. Nice. And then Chromatic Lantern. That's pretty good. Okay. Well, that was it for those three collector packs, mystery boxes, whatever you want to call them. Um, thanks for joining and sorry about the glitch out in the video. If you enjoyed, uh, make sure you hit the subscribe button so you can keep coming back and seeing the some random collector packs get open. Thank you.